have any idea what an ogre can do to you. They'll make a suit from your freshly peeled skin. Shake your liver. Squeeze the jelly from your eyes. <laughs> oh no! She's reciting Shrek lines! Remember that movie Shrek came out in 2001? Out of nowhere, just became this big monster hit, even won an Oscar for Best Animated Feature. But was it really that good? Well, I think I should check it out again. The movie was kind of a parody of Disney. It mocked the way they would dumb down public domain fairy tales, like adding unnecessary sidekicks and inserting a ton of pop culture references just to make the source material more marketable, allowing them to juice them for sequels, spin-offs, theme park rides, toys, and video games. Shrek is an ogre who's forced on a quest to save a princess by a pint-sized lord. On the way, Shrek gains allies, like a talking donkey, and learns the true meaning of friendship, onions, beauty being on the inside, and, you know, all that So anyway, I gotta re-watch Shrek, but of all these million streaming services, I don't know which one it's on. Is it Amazon or Peacock or whatever? And you know me, I'm old school, just got a new cell phone finally. So I need to track down a physical copy, even if it's VHS. I did get this VHS tape, Shrek Retold. This was sent by a fan. This is actually a remake scene by scene. Now that's some commitment right there, but we need to find the actual movie. Um, the video stores, well, that's out. Uh, I know, the library. And not just any library, the Library of Congress. That's right, Shrek was just entered into the National Film Registry. It is now as culturally significant as the original Dracula, 2001 Space Odyssey, Saving Private Ryan, and Citizen Kane. There's just one problem. I asked the Library of Congress for a copy, and they sent me this weird version that's for the Game Boy Advance which also came with Shark Tale. Ugh, how convenient. Your tax dollars at work. Yeah, there is this weird period in gaming history where you could get movies or TV shows made to play on your portable gaming console. I actually have a couple of movies made for the Sony PSP. Here we have Starship Troopers, awesome, and the not-awesome Black Dawn, starring Steven Seagal. Why the f do I even own this? I gotta be honest, I'd rather not watch Shrek on a tiny... Game Boy Advance screen. I want to watch it on my TV. So luckily, I have the Game Boy Player for the GameCube. The Game Boy Player is basically just an amped up Super Game Boy, but it can play Game Boy, Game Boy Color, and Game Boy Advance games all on your GameCube. And if I have to say game one more damn time, I'm going to go insane. Hmm, just realized, the whole playing Game Boy on your TV thing skipped the Nintendo 64. I mean, there was the Wide Boy 64, but it wasn't released to the public. That thing's almost as wide as Shrek's First, you grab your GameCube by the purse handle thing. Second, snap the player into the large port on the bottom, and then it has to be screwed in. You think that would be it? But no, you also need the Game Boy Player Disc. Without it, you're Remember how easy the Super Game Boy was? All you do, you take the cartridge, you put it in the Super Game Boy, and then you put that in your Super Nintendo, and boom, you're playing with power. But good luck not losing this tiny disc. Oh. Okay, so here's Shrek the movie on Game Boy Advance on GameCube, plus Sharkdale. The hell is this? I did everything right? Just let me watch Shrek already, damn it! Ugh, it turns out the Game Boy player can't play these types of movie packs. I guess Nintendo was afraid people would capture the movie footage and use it to sell bootlegs. Yeah, sell bootlegs of low resolution pixelated movies. So what am I gonna do now? Well, since I'm in a Shrek mood, I guess I'll see what games I have. While I'm looking for this game, remember when I said Shrek was a clever parody of Disney? 
Well, Shrek quickly became a parody of itself by also having a ton of sequels, spin-offs, theme park rides, toys, and of course, video games. All right, here we go. For the Game Boy Color, Shrek's fairy tale Freakdown? What the f is a Freakdown? I'm guessing it's ripping off the term Smackdown, which makes sense since this looks like a wrestling game and came out during WWF's Attitude Era. Plus, it's appropriate since there was a wrestling scene in the movie, so a Freakdown it is. First thing you need to do is pick a language. Well, hmm, let's see, American or English? I mean, what difference does it make? Is it gonna change the spelling of Game Boy Color? Next, you're greeted with a pixelated Shrek putting some poor dude in a headlock with a scary grin on his face. I'm gonna squash your head like a grip, mother Okay, let's hit start. And holy that donkey looks like That ass looks like I guess I'll just pick Shrek. Let's get ready to rumble in the jungle! I mean, the forest. Oh, God. What the f***? What the hell is wrong with Shrek's face? Wait, I thought this was wrestling. There's no grappling, pins, a referee, or even a ring. This is just a run-of-the-mill tournament fighter. Oh, and even worse, the controls are not responsive at all. The combos just won't register. Luckily, the big bad wolf is just a big bad and it's easy to take down. Just drop kick him until he dies. And I like watching Shrek dance while the wolf crumbles to the ground like a sack of potatoes. Next, you fight Pinocchio in a village. Pinocchio is a real Not only can he throw objects, but he can use his nose to hit you from further away. Oh great, now I'm dead. Did Shrek just fart? Yeah, he did it. It's not like he got the fart punched out of him. He fell over, went stiff, and then farted, which means that he died. I mean, he, like, his muscles relaxed, his sphincters loosened, and fecal matter has escaped. So this was his death Ah, oh, Shrek died and had a death If you do get to beat that puppet Pinocchio, you move into the dungeon to fight, um, the Riddler? Oh, no, it's just the gingerbread man on candy cane stilts. Well, now he's just there looking off. I'd be off too if I was vaporized by a clearly constipated Shrek over here. Next is the swamp, where we have a mirror match like in Mortal Kombat. It's Shrek on Shrek carnage! I gotta fight myself, and honestly, one of the greatest enemies to overcome in your life is yourself. So this game is rather, eh, poetic. You know, the mirror matches do show me how great Shrek can be to play as if you can actually pull off his special moves. He farts fire and projectile vomits across the entire screen. Shame these controls are such I'd love to pull off a ha pukin. After killing yourself, it's off to the wrestling ring. Really? Finally? It's now a wrestling game? Nope, you just fight the executioner inside of a wrestling ring looking stage. Bogus. In the movie, the wrestling ring scene wasn't a real ring. It was a horse stable. So did the coders not watch the movie? Anyway, the executioner dies and does a flip. Lastly, you head to the mirror room to easily beat Lord Quad or whatever his name is, and that's it. That's the entire game. No story, no ending, no nothing. Just a screen that says champion. And then you're sent back to replay the game as other awful characters you've unlocked. I tried some of them too but it didn't make much of a difference. After you beat the game once, there's no reason to go back. Zero replay value. You know what? F this game and f the Game Boy movie and f the GameCube player thingy, whatever, and f Shark Tale while you're at it. F the very plastic this game was made on and f the movie Shrek, it's overrated. I don't know why the Library of Congress has to have that one. What the f Playtime is over. Oh dear. Oh! <laughs>
Well, that was some dumb luck. Come on, come on. I'm almost away from these Shrek freaks. Who the f builds their personality on Shrek? Ah, oh. oh, Broger Shrek. Uh, I mean, Shrek is love. Shrek is life. Indeed. Is our special guest ready for the ritual? Uh, yeah, he sure is, my booger. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some creepy Shrek erotica to write. That's the spirit, but not right now. The ceremony's about to begin. What's the matter with you? you? Call that dancing? Oh! This Shrek smash mouth and you! Excellent ruse, nerd, but the game is ogre. Quit it with the Shrek puns already, and game over? What game? The game of the played leading the player. You see, we sent you that Game Boy movie. What? <laughs> yeah. No, I got that from the library. Of Congress? All according to plan. Shrek's disciples have reached the highest level of government. How else would we have gotten Shrek into the library of Congress? So. You were testing me? Don't you see? We are testing everyone. Testing your loyalty to our ogre lord. A test. You have failed. This is the part where you get sacrificed. What? You're gonna kill me? Because I don't like Shrek? It's a 20 year old movie! You people are crazy! I don't believe any of this! Well, allow me to make you a believer, nerd. What? What are you thinking? Oh, uh, in the name of God! Uh, what are you thinking? 